good so you are maths physics chemistry biology history um, i am having pcmb okay and yes, uh, your english is good logic kind of logical reasoning analytical skill mathematical ability data analysis data analysis uh, i don't have any idea about that but this verbal reasoning i'm uh, like working on it i've just started not verbal reasoning alone verbal logical reasoning not analytical logical. skill how do you prepare for that uh, i have uh, uh, i have got some materials and i have received some um, materials and resources from there i have started like uh, what uh, sequence and series they are following and in that some tricks and tips i am following so okay. that i can so understand it is questions. not understanding and doing the problems it is how fast you do it many people can solve i can also run 100 meters but i will not win if i don't run faster so it is not running 100 meters is important how fast i run as we are going so similarly the logical reasoning analytical skill basic mathematics arithmetic and all are how fast you are going to do that this yes, doctor and there are a lot of tricks okay so why are you not getting time because you are not using tricks to find solutions for problems what is 45 into 45 it will take me time yeah it will not take time because um, pratyusha write 5 square yes doctor put a dash 5 into 5 is 5 square 5 square put a dash how much 5 square 5 square 625 five square 5 square 25 sir 25 25 15 square how much 625 15 square 15 15 where did you get this 625 for everything you are saying 625 no i heard 25 square no 15 square it would take me time 225 25 square 625 yeah write it you write in the sequence like this one below the other one Okay, doctor. Thirty-five square. Thousand two hundred and twenty-five. Forty-five square. Two thousand twenty-five. That means two zero two five. So what is yes, that sir. you have seen? Twenty-five is common. What are the other numbers if you analyze? Twenty-five. Mm -hmm. Square becomes two into three. Thirty-five square becomes three into four. You see how? Three what is four. it? So forty-five square becomes four into five. That is what you have written before twenty-five. Yes, okay. So it becomes twenty twenty-five, yes, okay. right? Okay. See the logical reasoning, analytical skill, verbal. It is to test how good you are in listening. That's what I did just now. you understood when you are doing yes, something when you are listening to somebody else don't think something else listen you cannot be a military officer without listening to the orders that time you think something else that is what is being tested in competitive exams a good student is one who is not smart by themselves then don't come to appear in front of me when you are in front of me you are not smart you are obedient you are listening you are following you understood yes doctor what happens is the logical reasoning questions are mathematics but not mathematics this is explained in english or the questions are asked in english then you think that it is mathematics finished now i will ask you i have four eggs in my basket four eggs in my basket okay i broke one okay i fried one i ate one how many 
Eggs are balanced in the basket. One. You are wrong. I cannot eat without frying. I cannot fry without breaking. So it's the same egg which I broke. I fried and I ate. Suppose if I have shown like this, I broke one, I fried one, I ate one, you would have told one again. But you internally did it. Did I show you that? No. no, no, no. I said four eggs and then took my hand off. So this is logical, no mathematics there. This is verbal logic. So must be very careful, very sharp. Yes, How do you get it? Not by reading, not by looking at a lot of examples. It's through discussions. Yes, you need a good company. So what happens generally, assume that you are running and you are in a race and all the people who are running with you are slow runners. Will you ever win a medal? In your life? Maybe if, even if I win, it would be of no matter. I mean, everyone is running slow. Slow. Understood. When you really go for a match, you will see a lot of people who are much higher. So your company should be with the higher levels of people. What I have seen, so I can learn. What I have seen in Kolkata and all is most of the people go for tuitions. You know who goes for tuitions? Those who are quite useless. Those who cannot understand what is taught in the classrooms. You have option in the classroom to ask questions to your teachers. Do you think your teacher is useless? No, no if they are useless, you must complain to the principal, complain to the manager, change them, get good teachers there. You are wasting, that is why you don't have time. Yes, why, why you don't have time? Because you are in the class and again you are in the tuition center where the same thing is repeated, no? Yes, sir. Why do people repeat? When they don't understand. Why are you not understanding? Not paying attention. You are, why are you not paying attention? Because you know, assume that I am asking you to clean a burthen. And then somebody else will come and ask you again to clean it before the food is served. You will not clean very well in the first time because you know somebody is going to ask you again to clean it. So you know you are going to listen to the same class again in the tuition center. Your first attention will be less. And you know you have already, see assume you are, you are going to visit a place. This is the last chance for you to see that place. Your attention will be to see everything because of the last chance. Assume you know that I am going to see in that place many times. You will say, yeah, next time tomorrow I can see, right? So you become so casual. That is why you don't get time. Yes, doctor. So what you should do, you attend the class. Before attending the class, you read the whole syllabus, chapter with you. You have your syllabus, you have your textbook. You know yes, what sir. teachers are going to teach tomorrow, including English poetry. Yes, sir. You can also read, look at the dictionary, understand the whole meaning, look at every... Don't look for the meaning. Look the full meaning in the dictionary. So that tomorrow when the word comes, contextually it will have a different meaning. You are not looking for it. Because you learn, you know the meaning of that word. Once you are ready like that and then go and sit in the class, the teacher speaks every word will be known to you. Have you ever seen the dictionary meaning of resistance? Resistance. Resistance in physics. Capacitor, conductor, reflector, absorption, emission. These are all technical words, but they are not technical words. They are English words. Look at the dictionary. Where is your dictionary beside you? You tell me. In the 
No, no student should have dictionary somewhere else. 20 minutes rule. Immediately pick it up. Otherwise, you will delay. Number one. Number two, you need not have a physical dictionary today because digitally it's available. Wordhippo.com. That's a, that's a beautiful dictionary. You know what is hip? So what is? You have a hip. Yes, yes. And all the dance is with the hip only. Yes, so word you are dancing with the words playing with the words that's why it is called word hippo.com then you don't have to write it down also you will remember so I made you to learn the website name with the logic adding to that with analyzing the meaning word is dance. yeah how do you remember this you remember the word hippo.com because the way I explain to you the website name also. So everything which comes in front of you, analyze it. Now I will not uh, forget your name Pratyusha Adhigari because Adhigari. I called you like that so that it becomes in my mind. Okay. So you should have good logic. Analyze everything with the logic. Critically thinking is this. It is not during examination for critical thinking. I go for coaching somewhere else and then get a coach, uh, critical thinking in my brain and I answer it. No, it doesn't work. You can develop it with a lot of examples, but you should have it with your daily routine practice. Yes, sir. Okay, then when yes, you read the whole thing and sit in the classroom, you will have a lot of questions. Don't leave your teacher without asking few questions. Don't disturb them. Or assume you don't have time for that. You go to the tuition center where with a bunch of questions to ask. If they cannot answer, there is no point in attending tuitions. You all students who are going for tuition should decide tomorrow onwards I am going to ask critical questions and then I must get an explanation for that. Doctor. I keep saying you are paying money to Narayana yes, doctor. and your teachers are your servants because you are paying them. Your, teach, your tuition teacher definitely is your servant. You understood? So don't leave them free. I am not your servant because I am not charging you. I am your master. Okay, so if you are paying, they become your servant. They should listen to you. They should, you should ask questions and they should answer. To create such questions, you must think about it. You must follow instructions very strict. You are not asking if you don't understand. Hesitation. So what happens? All the time which you are spending with me would have gone waste. I would have thought I taught you if I don't check immediately. So I am wasting time. You are also wasting time. This is what happens in the classroom. This is what happens in the tuition centers also. No. You have to finish. Then and there. Okay. Otherwise. That is why you don't find time. For most of the activities. If you study once. Now you don't have to work on that. Now I taught you some technique. You don't have to look at it again in your life. Finished. One for all. Now you tell me what is. 56 into. 44. 56 into. I will take time. Yeah. Now, what is that I asked you? 56. 56 is 50 plus 6. You write it immediately. Don't look at my face and blink. 56 is 50 plus 6. What is 44? 50 minus 6. 50 minus 6. So, what did I ask you? 50 plus 6 into 50 minus 6. Is it not A minus B into A plus B? 
What is a minus b into a plus b? A square minus b. So tell me what is that here now? Fifty square minus six square. square. Fifty square is two thousand five hundred. Uh, two thousand five hundred. Two thousand five hundred minus thirty six will be two thousand four hundred and sixty four. Did I write it somewhere or did I just tell you like this? Spontaneously. How? Because I learned a formula a minus b into a plus b is equal to a square minus b square. Are you getting what I'm saying? Now you learned twenty five into okay thirty five into thirty five. You learned. What is thirty five into thirty five? One two two five. Now my question is not thirty five into thirty five. Thirty five into thirty four. Thirty plus four. No, don't do that. Just now you did thirty five into thirty five. How much? Ah, uh, one two two five. Now I am asking thirty four into thirty five. So one less thirty five, no? One less. So you are multiplying thirty five times thirty five. Now my question was thirty four. So one less. So it is one two two five minus twenty five. One two two double zero thousand two hundred. This is what is logic. Yes. How fast you think so that you can solve the problem with whatever knowledge you have is what is jugad. Correct or not? So you must you must look logically, not learn logic. Be logic. How do you be logic? Lot of questions like this. Did I teach you anything new? Nothing. All that you know, but what I taught you is a trick. Okay. Suppose hundred into hundred and one, you don't have to do it. You know hundred into hundred plus one more hundred is the answer, no? But you can see most of the people will write it down. No, don't have to do it. So, which formula is to be used? A minus b into a plus b is equal to a square minus b square is in some place. in some other place it can be something else so look at the problem and find solutions why this military test is being conducted with all these every time you don't get same problem in the world in life also you don't get same problem you get different problems so that time how critically you analyze the situation to find the smart solution for which you need lot of trials in your life What, they will not see you cannot ask when the commander gives you an order you cannot ask him repeat it once again did, what did you tell i did not follow all that will not work no. so one command how are you going to understand it english comprehension very important yesterday soon after the session immediately one of the student had sent me all that what i spoke during the one and a half hour as a note that is the good students oh this is what it is immediately i have sent that report to that owner of that school who is my friend saying that there is one student in your school who is fit to be a student so taking note making note what did you learn see when you see a youtube i demand people who are my students to write down what did you learn from that as a note so prepare a note when you see a movie understand it write a review on that when you read a book write a review on that got it so for everything you be very serious when studies you are serious while playing you do lot of rehearsals for dancing on a stage that is with full interest were you dancing on that program there was a principals meet for which i came actually that is how i came to kolkata and i was actually i was not there my school was not in valkyrie so with all that fun and all that you know after two days i did something good that is going to uh, that uh, send saviors to school and then spend some time with children that is because 
during the program there were few students who were participants there and they they pulled me out on the corridor we were discussing and i asked which school you are so i was get i was impressed by the initiative by the students so i said i have one more half day i will come to your school tomorrow so prepare well think don't just read every word look at dictionary now your physics you are reading with a dictionary beside you chemistry with a dictionary beside you okay all the time what you spent tomorrow when you go to the class you will see a fabulous difference in capturing the every word you now you realize resistance means it doesn't move very smooth so the wire has a resistance means it doesn't allow conductivity that easily it stops conduction when it stops conduction there will be friction when there is friction definitely temperature will go that is why that is why it burns and that is why it is used in the heating coil that is why it is used in the iron box and some material when it burns instead of heat it provides light the frequency is such so the material has got a chemistry to generate light in specific color because its electromagnetic energy is such the vibrations are different frequencies are different the wavelength is different the wavelength changes frequency changes this has got a frequency like this so wavelength is far wavelength is small frequency will become more wavelength is less frequency becomes more because the wave goes up and down with minimum number of space it goes many times wavelength is more only once it will go like this these are all sine curve and yesterday i was teaching trigonometry did you see that no doctor i didn't you, you, you go to dr tps you will see trigonometry dr tps yesterday day for yesterday only we discussed trigonometry some student came and told okay. we don't understand trigonometry so i i did it okay and write down what did you follow what did you get from there it's an entirely different style of teaching you have seen my teaching is not the same way what you have seen anywhere else okay yes, i daddy. i understand i know i know subjects i don't learn i know 